one study that we did actually, we wanted, um, it, this study is actually going to be published very soon in, in, in Tier 1 Scientific Magazine because it's really fascinating. We took basal plants and we watered some with regular water and some with NLM water. Then we created a short-term drought to create mm. a stressor. Okay. And then we let the plants recover. And we use this latest fluorescence-based technology. There are actually only two labs in, in, in all of Europe that has this very particular technology that uses 3D scanner to uh, collect a mountain of data on what happens within the plant on a molecular level. Okay. And we were testing like over 30 markers, like how the plant is using water to cool itself, how it's using the light in the photosynthesis, how efficiently it's doing it, chlorophyll, and how the changes in this pigment actually happen and the implications of that. In almost every single marker, we had more than significant improvements in wow. the plant itself. 